Hi guys. How my client cheaply made a kit car of the James Bond's Aston Martin from my digital car body buck files. I used a 3D scan model of the James Bond's Aston Martin. I work only with accurate 3D scan models, scale 1 to 1. After that I divided this 3D scan model into sections. The standard step between the main car body buck sections 10 cm. Step for front and rear sections 5 cm. Then I saved a digital car body buck sections in JPEG and DXF format. This digital car body buck files need to print on a regular paper printer. You can use absolutely any paper printer. Or need to cut on a CNC or laser machine to obtain wooden car body buck sections. From this wooden sections need to assemble a car buck. My client made metal sections and assembled the sections one after another to get a car buck. That's like Lego, but for men. Everyone can do it easily. Then the space between the sections need to fill with construction foam and the surface covered with construction putty. Alternative option, my client welded metal plates between the sections. After that, he covered the layout with putty and brought the surface to perfection. Next, need to make fiberglass molds for the further production of a fiberglass body. Kit car, my client didn't have this skill either. The main thing is that you made fiberglass molds once, you can make many fiberglass bodies. Fiberglass car body made from resulting fiberglass molds. All you need is epoxy resin and glass material. Nowadays it is available to everyone. There is nothing difficult about working with fiberglass. The finished fiberglass car body, kit car, is installed on a suitable donor car or on a homemade frame. The James Bond's Aston Martin DB5 replica is ready. The most important thing is to make the body. It's like Lego, but for men. Many of my clients make this without any experience. If you need digital car body buck files for self-building a James Bond's Aston Martin DB5 replica yourself, then... Welcome!